sometimes when you're working on a project, you know when something is good. The tradition that the shape or the design has, and that's what our challenge was as designers, you know, bring that into the future without losing that flair that Vesper has. As designers, we are like a sponge. Anything that happens around us, you get all these things that influence your next project. I remember growing up with Brown as a brand. I remember this alarm clock. It was white, few graphics. It's made in such an intelligent way that is amazing. The simplicity of the design that lasts forever. And that's, that's a big lesson I got from that. Number one, and no doubt about it, is the Vincent Black Shadow. That's a 1930s bike, you know, that still today makes a lot of sense. The second one is the Britain, still today, you know, those bikes when you look at them and say, wow. The third one to me is the Suzuki Katana, 1982. That was the first time, you know, the Japanese understood that they needed to create a design that would be more appealing to, to a wider range of people. Then I really enjoyed, you know, this, the motocross bikes of the 70s. I grew up, you know, racing motocross until I broke my teeth in, when I was 18, but that's another story for another time. You know, my favorite bike of all was my first bike. I was eight years old. I wanted to be like Charlie Watts. I wanted to be a drummer. My uncle, instead of giving me a drum set, he gave me this Chrysler Florent 1959 bike. I was with, you know, we started with my brother riding, then we never stopped. 